everyone i have a collective haul for you guys all fun girly things get your notepad out your notes i will leave all of the links to everything that i will show below because i'm going to show a range from makeup to clothes to jewelry to everything is in this haul okay so let's get straight to it okay so first i'm going to start with city color cosmetics they released they released some new products, and I'm going to show them to you guys. I will have the direct link to all of this stuff below, so make sure you check them out. They came out with new highlighting ones, and there are three shades that I will set. This first shade right here is in Moscato, and it's like an icy silver cream color right here. I will set this rose gold color and blush wine. It's like a pinky, rosy color. And then I was also sent a gold one in champagne. So I'm in certain swatches, and I will leave the link to all of these below. Make sure you go over to City Color Cosmetics to check them out. How I will use these is to highlight my cheekbones. You can uh, mix them in with foundation. I don't know if I typically use them because I'm oily, so I stray away from creamy, um, dewy products on my face. But yeah, you can use them as eyeshadow bases or whatever you want to use them for. They're multi-purpose ones, okay? I will come back with tutorials showing you guys how to use these products. But right now, I'm just introducing them okay, to you Okay, so they came out with six colors of their metallic shadow pots, okay, you guys? These are very similar to my favorite mousses from them. The white pearl mousse and the gold mousse. I absolutely love these, especially for your inner tear duct and etc. They're in the same packaging and everything is these. They just have another name to them. The Metallic Shadow Pots in six colors were released. So I'm just gonna go through all the colors real quick and I'm gonna insert swatches. This gold right here is in Shooting Star. And I absolutely love these, you guys. I swatch these on my hand. They dry really quick. Um, they don't bleed, they don't crease. And they are extremely hard to get off, so you guys need to invest in these because I absolutely love them. I have this color right here. It's like a copper color, and it is in Cosmo. Now, I have a color that's very similar to it, and it is in Solar right here. Oh, my gosh. I love these and cannot wait to pop some tutorials out with them. This color right here is in Nebula. And it's like a duo chrome with glitter. It is exceptionally gorgeous right here. And then I will set two blue shades. One is more on the teal side. And this color right here is in Meteor Shower. And I have a darker blue that is in Galaxy. So I am highly impressed with these. I mean love 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 them i was just so impressed when i did the swatches so i will leave the link to these below so that you guys okay can next i will be moving into some smell goods for you guys i got some products from a company called shay shay bakery and it is skincare you guys and oh my gosh i was floored when i opened my packaging i have the strawberry shortcake body butter not only it, does it feel exceptional on the body? It moisturizes the skin. The smell is like fantastic. Like I can just sit here. I, oh my gosh, it smells so freaking good, you guys. I will make sure I leave the link to this company below along with a discount code if I have it. But the, the um, fragrance is Strawberry Shortcake. And look at the top. Oh, that is just gorgeous. It is like Strawberry Shortcake. Stupid cute, okay? So, yes, I'm really enjoying that body butter. And then they also sent me the Strawberry Shortcake Sugar Scrub with Shea Nut, Apricot, and Coconut Oil. And it comes in a container like this, okay? So, this is what that looks like in the inside. So, yes, you guys, make sure you check this company out. I am super excited and highly satisfied with my products. I love little, you guys know I love little cute girly like stuff and this is just bum. It reminded me of when I was younger and I had my strawberry shortcake bedroom set. I absolutely Okay, love so it. if you're on Instagram, you 
saw a picture of some jewelry. I am not a, now a part of the Rocks Box crew. And this is what their jewelry come in. Just this very cute box like this. Now what this is is a monthly subscription site. You pay $19.99 per month and you have a rotating closet of jewelry. You get three pieces to start with and you decide if you want to keep those three pieces. If you want to keep trading them in for a new uh, set of three pieces. And that's how I go. Now, I do have a code where you can try your first month free. So how that works is they send you three pieces. And I'm going to show you the three pieces that I got. And what you can do is you can wear them all in the first week. Send them all back. Get your three more pieces. The next week, send them all back. You just rotate. And if you decide to keep any of the pieces, you can pay for that that piece by itself. So you just rotate, rotate. If you see two pieces that you like, and one you don't, you send that one back after you wear that. I mean, it's just, it just rotates. It's a very, very good concept. If you don't want to buy statement pieces and stuff all the time, kind of like having your own little personal stylist, right, where you just rent it out and take it back when you're done and trade it in for something else. So this is my first piece right here. It is just a turquoise statement piece. Absolutely adorable. And then I got this piece right here, which I think I already wore in a video. And it's um, kind of a minty, tilly color, and it has a little bling on the bottom, and it's also a statement piece. This is my second piece that was in the box. And then I also got this very simple piece. Now, I'm not a simple girl, so this probably, I would probably send this back. And when you send it back, you do get a, a dress stamp um, sticker, so you don't have to pay for shipping. And this is what it looks like right here. It just has a little cute heart. It's real little and dainty. Y'all know I'm just extra, so I can't do nothing with that little piece. So after I wear it, um, I'm going to go ahead and send that one back and exchange it for another piece. And then after I wear the two, I'm going to send them back and just keep it okay. back to Sephora, you guys. Now, Shopkick. I had $200 more worth of Shopkicks. But let me tell you guys, there is a limit to invites. Um, you can only invite 100 people and you max out on invites. Come on, I know you guys didn't think it was going to be that easy. Um, because a lot of people are under the Shopkick page saying it was a scam and whatever, but it's not. Now, after you max out on invites, you can continue to get your walk-ins for walking into school stores. Your scans when you get into stores, but you cannot get the points for inviting people. So, after you have invited people, you can no longer get those 2,000 points. So, what I did was I went and got the Glam Glow Power Cleanse, the green one. Now, I have the white one, and I absolutely love it. So, I wanted to try this one, and this one is higher for some reason. It's 44, and it's, the other ones are 39. And so, I also got the black one, and these are daily cleansers. And this is the Youth Cleanse, because this one is really good for exfoliating your skin. So, I picked up both of those when I was in there this last trip. I also picked up the Makeup Forever Artist One Palette, and this is just a steal. It's like $40, and you get nine colors, like the size of MAC eyeshadows. And so, I picked up that one, and that one is the first one. And then I also picked up the second one. So, yes, I cannot wait to play in those because we know Makeup Forever don't play. While I'm on Makeup Forever, I picked up the Duo Matte Powder because I see the Socialite Life wear this all the time. And you guys know I'm oily, so I wanted to give that a try. They did send my Becca powder that was broke the last time back to me. So, yeah, this is my new one. The Becca Low Light Highlight Powder right there. I got um, a little thing of the, the Slick Makeup Setting Spray from Urban Decay for myself. And then I got the Micro Beauty Blenders. Now, I wouldn't have never bought these with my own money. But I just want to see what all the hype is about, really. So, I picked them up since I was in there and since I had the Shopkick card. Okay, okay. next I'm going to move it to She Inside. I usually save She Inside for like a clothing haul. But both of these pieces were too little, so I'm not going to even waste my time. But yeah, they are beautiful pieces. This one right here is in a 2X. And remember, this is a Chinese-based website, so you go up two sizes. But I just knew this stuff stretched, so I'll be able to wear it. And honey, look at this. I put this up against my little girl, and she could wear it. It's like a gray flare out top, just a plain t-shirt type feel. 
And then they sent me, I was super sad I couldn't wear this because I'm on this whole denim thing right now. But they sent me a denim button-up shirt. The inside just has a little floral right there. And that's what the back look like. So yeah, those two pieces were a womp womp. I thought I would be able to wear that denim jacket open, but mm -mm, it got me doing this movement where I can't even move. So I'm just going to hop straight into some items that I got from Diamonds by Monet Cosmetics. They came to my ma uh, makeup mixer, which I do have the vlog coming up for that. But I want to get the professional clips that the uh, videographer did. Um, but he's taking a while, so I might just go ahead and bring you my my clips from my camera that Bay recorded. But that was awesome. But anyway, Diamonds by Monet Cosmetics had a booth there. So they gave me some lip products. This first one right here is in Comfort Zone. And I'm going to swatch them all over to the left of me. Um, this pretty pink is in Smitten. And then this black right here is in black, is it blacklist? Blacklist. So I will leave the link to Diamonds by Monet Cosmetics below the video if you're interested in any of these products. The, the products I just showed have a minty menthol feel and smell to them. And um, I got some lipsticks. They're matte, okay? And all of this stuff is super pigmented if you'll see by the swatches. This first purple right here is in once upon a time it's just like a lavender shade and then i got a more true purple in island punch and then this last pink shade i got is in scandal so like i said i will leave the link to them below make sure you guys check them out Let's move on. Hello. My last Dollar Tree haul, I said that I was done with Dollar Tree. I was just looking for the beauty blenders that they have, some cosmetic bags that they have, and it was something else I was looking for, which must not be too important because I can't remember what it was. And um, one of my beautiful subscribers, Mandy, sent me the makeup bags. And when I say she sent them to me, guys, look at this. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So I'm a, it's three different patterns. I'm going to just show you one of each. And I probably save these for like when I do my next mixer to put them in a goodie bag because I don't need all of these cosmetic bags. But that was like so sweet. It's the kind that opens like this, like a little travel bag. And for a dollar, you guys, it's durable. It's not cheapy feeling. But this one has like some lips and lipsticks on it. Okay, and it's black and white. I have this one right here that's just like it, but it's pink and white. And then I have this one right here that just has like a floral print to it. And it's pink, black, and turquoise. So thank you so much, Mandy, for sending me those. I was like super excited. Like, what? She just sent me the whole show. Let me find out you clear those. Natural Beauty 23 always sends me items. I tell you guys all the time that I've met her at the makeup show, Dallas. And she's actually going to be helping me work the makeup show Dallas this year. But anyway, um, she's, she was out buying herself something and saw it in purple and thought of me. And I just be floored, y'all. I'll be like, oh my gosh, that is just so sweet for you guys to think of me. But it's from a company called One Odd Bird. And she basically sent me this business card holder, which I do need. I pull my business card my business cards out of like a little... Um, cosmetic bag and it's just purple and it's leather and you just stick your cards in here and it comes in this cute little uh, pouch the packaging along is just like so exquisite and then she also sent me this portfolio and it's in purple because you guys know I've gotten some planning lately and so I was like yes look at this case and this is what it looked like it's just purple it looks like a little clutch huh and this is what it looked like you could just put your business receipts your stickers or whatever you want to put in here plenty of room and i just thought that was too cute so thank you so much for my More items for my friend yvette her beauty grant beauty gram instagram handle is beauty is my habit she always sends me my blinged out stuff if you guys are watching my um how i stay organized video she sent me like a lot of my ipad covers and stuff so look at this cup 
Oh my gosh, it's a Starbucks cup. I don't drink coffee, but I do love drinking out of pretty cups. You guys know I love pretty things. So it's blinged out and it has my initials right here. It's a little glare. And then look at the top. Oh my gosh, this is just gorgeous. So I'm going to be drinking like... <laughs> so she also sent me an iPad mini cover. And look at that. She sent me my the current one that's like red, black, and white. And this one is purple. And it just has like all these cute little trinkets on it. And it is just absolutely adorable. Um, DD Expressions. Expressions by D. And I will leave all of her information below so that you can get your... She blings out anything. If you can bling it out, she's about to bling out my scent bird bottle. So, yeah. Um, she made me a case. She didn't make this, but she made me... A case for my iPad to match my phone so that is super adorable so make sure you check her out and show okay her a couple of more items I got from somebody um one of my dear friends saw this ring at Ashley Stewart and got it for me it's just the lips with the um, lipstick and I actually have this ring already in like four colors but yeah it was the um, thought that counts and so I'm gonna wear it too and then another one of my clients I always wear these really thick hoops and I always ask her where she get them from because they're real thick and heavy duty. And so she brought me a pair of silver and gold. Um, one of my favorite clients, Sharon, she brought them to me when she got her makeover one day last week. So, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys those. I went to Ross and they had this City Color Cosmetics set. Now, I know City Color Cosmetics will send me this, but it was only like $4.99 in Ross. And it came with this pretty blush, highlighter, and bronzer. And I like all three shades, you guys. So, I just picked that up since I was already in there. I also got this LA Splash. And you guys know how I feel about them. I have their Liquid Couture on right now. And forbidden apple or something like that they had these glitter liners it's five different colors and it was $5.99 I mean you cannot beat that yes that's under a dollar each well a little over a dollar each like a dollar 25 each but yeah and they are awesome also they had the this matte blush palette and I already have this and I absolutely love it the pigmentation and everything is great so I got a backup because it was only $5.99 now when I bought it at the beauty supply it was only $5.99 also but I haven't been able to find them at the beauty supply and then I got the same palette but it is in the cream form it's it was $6.99 and I usually don't do cream blushes but I don't know why I picked that up I guess I'll save it for a giveaway or something also, when I was in Ross, I saw this hat, and it just says selfie, and it was $5.99, so I picked that up, and I found those body shapers. If you guys watch my body shaper video, you guys know I like wearing the ones that look like panties, and I found this one right here in Ross, and it was $10.99, so I picked that up, and then I saw this commercial <laughs> with these leggings, and they like lift your butt and stuff, like as seen on TV. They're really, really good leggings, and they were only $6.99 in Ross. So I picked those up. You can never have too many pair of leggings and black ones at that. And then I also got some jeggings that are black, and they have like faux pockets on the back or whatever. And these were $8.99 in Ross. I got some more items, but I want to my little girl birthday party Sunday. Some white pants and a like a denim like shirt and i'll insert a picture of that but yeah i got all that from ross so you guys know that i love ross when i want to find my little quick you know girly trinkets and outfits and stuff so i went by the costco and i already put all of the other stuff i bought in my kit but i did pick up this graptobian foundation palette it was 26.99 um and this one right here is in ultra lights and i just needed some um shades and instead of going to buy five uh you know lighter or caucasian or pillar type foundations from mac i just bought this palette because i'm not going to use this palette as much as i use my mac foundations also i left these out of my dollar tree haul but i want to show them to you guys in case you were interested i know you guys have been seeing the maybelline color tattoo pure pigments the 24 hour pigments they have a lot of colors but i just picked up the yellow and the green one and these are at the Dollar Tree. I remember when these came out, we went crazy. And they were like 10 bucks then. But now they're at the Dollar Tree. So I'm going to move into Ashley Stewart. I went, I had some Kirby Cash or whatever 
dollars or some I had and I had a hundred dollars worth I want to say so I got this purse it is just the cutest little thing it's very springy and floral it was originally $29.50 but I had a 40% off coupon and a five dollar off coupon so I ended up getting this purse for like $13 and yeah I could see styling it on an outfit for my blog or something okay I picked a couple of more items up in Ashley Stewart and I should have saved these for a plus size try on because you're not going to get the full effect of how they look but I got this um this denim jogger set it's just pants and it's like acid washed and the pants to it was um $29.50 and then it has like a little top to it like a jogger type top with a hood like that and this top was um $34.50 so I picked that up out of Ashley Stewart's also and I usually don't shop in there but I had to go spend them curvy dollars or whatever they were and um, I also got this denim shirt it was $39.50 it's just a plain denim shirt Okay, and then I got this bodysuit to like wear under something, and it's just this very pretty pinky neon and sheer in the middle. It's just a bodysuit, and this was um marked down from forty nine fifty all the way to five dollars. So I just picked it up because it was so cheap. So I'm gonna move it to this rack right here. I picked it up from my local wholesale for twelve bucks because I needed somewhere to store my shades. And that will transition me into what I got to show next. So I got some shades. You can find these at Retro City Sunglasses. I'm going to just go through them really fast. This is the first pair. It's like an over exaggerated cat eye pair. Yes. Okay. I got this pair right here. This has pearls around it. You guys know I'm into cat eye lately. You'll see that trend with all the glasses I'm about to show. I also got this pair. They just have gold at the top. And they're blue. This pair right here. So, so that's all of the shades that I received. And I just love them. So you guys know I talk about Tracy all the time. It's a consignment shop for designer items. You can get... um used and new they sell new stuff too designer items for cheap they always have discount codes so i will leave the Tracy link below and the designer stuff is real it's not a replica so i got some more shades i got some dolce and gabbana shades okay now i had a credit i did not pay for this stuff um i had a credit for them so yeah um these shades were a hundred dollars i want to say and they are dolce and gabbana shades and this is what they look like just a very wide frame and look at the side this is what got me right here i was like oh oh look look at that leaking that's the first pair of shades that i got from them and it comes with everything in the case the bag and everything and these were used on the website but they are still in very good condition now that oh not crazy what the what am I talking about? Wrong company. The real, real. <laughs> so they come in this little bag like this. I did get something from Tracy too, so maybe that's why I'm confused. These glasses are from the real, real. So I got a Kate Spade pair also. Now I want to say these are 50 or 60 bucks. In this case, it's just extremely nice. And they are just a brown cat eye pair like this. And they have the little Kate Spade logo right here. And this is what they look like on. Okay, okay, so something happened with her flight. And so she had to catch the next one. And so it was like a two, three hour layover. We were so irritated. So she saw these in the gift shop and got them for me. They are made by Ralph Lauren. Like, I need any more shades. But you guys know we spoil the heck out of each other. And she got them because they are purple. And I do not have any purple shades. They are so cute. Oh my gosh. Yeah. So thanks, Bay. I absolutely love them. The color of them, I love them. And yeah, those are made by Ralph Lauren. So now we're on Tracy. 
I had a credit to their site also. And how you get credits is just like anything else, like Shopkick and anything else. You tell people to sign up, and when they make a purchase, you get a credit. So I got this um, Louis Vuitton. Oh, I forgot the name of this. Something Papillon, Papillon, something like this. But it's the mini one, and I saw it on there. And this is what it looked like. Isn't that just the cutest thing ever? But I'm going to use it to store my um, lipsticks and stuff in in my purse. Like my lipsticks and mascara and stuff. But pick that up. And I can't remember how much this was. It was like 100 and something. But yeah. Super cute. I'm going to jump around. And I got this from Amazon. And the reason why I got it is because I transport my ring light, which I am using. This is I'm using the big one. I transport it from the shop to the house, from the shop to the house, and I got tired of that. So I convinced Bae to give me another one. And this one I got from Amazon for 80 something dollars, and it works just fine. Now it don't dim and stuff like the one that I'm using. Like the one that I'm using, I can dim it. And let me see, can I show you guys that? You guys can see that. Yeah, I can dim it and stuff, but with this one, I can't, and this one did not come with a filter, the one that I'm using came with a filter, so I got this one so that I can leave it at the house and don't have to transport this light back and forth from the house to the shop, okay? I will leave the Amazon link below for that. Last. Gosh, this haul is going to be like an hour, but... You guys haven't seen me in a minute, so it's okay, it's okay. You not, you guys know that I did my makeup mixer by myself. It was a lot of work because I had a lot of sponsors, a lot of workers, a lot of, but it was 100% successful in my eyes. Thank you, Jesus. I didn't see anything that I can complain about. Everything went like I vision. And, you know, I was really, really scared because at first, I didn't even want to do it because I wanted to do like a mingle where we just come and we play makeup. But everybody was like, no, get a model and do a demonstration. And I don't want to do that because, you know, you listen to people on Instagram and stuff and they're like, what qualifies you to teach a class? And yeah, so you're like thinking you're not good enough. But then I'm like, fuck that. If the people want it, I'm going to give it to them. People have been requesting it, requesting it over and over and over. And when I drop the link, it sold out instantly. So, you guys, you know, a lot of times we play into what people doing and saying on Instagram, you're not good enough. You have, aren't working on celebrities. You aren't doing this. You haven't been in the business long enough. But if you're good, you're good. If the people like you, they're going to come. If the people want it, give it to them. No, you know, don't listen to what people tell you what you can and can't do because you haven't been doing this long enough. You haven't been working on this person. You haven't been working. You know, nowadays they equate working on celebrities and stuff as being successful. But I guarantee you, if we match bank accounts, I'm right there. No, as a matter of fact, I might be better off than you because celebrities and stuff don't like to pay. So... Hmm, okay, so we're going to jump off that subject before this turns into a rent video. So, I came home from work one day, and I had a new purse on my bed. I didn't feel the need to bring the box and all that in here. But they bought me the Louis Vuitton Eva, I want to say. And I just got a new Speedy for Christmas and hadn't even started wearing it. So, I was like, I mean, some, I was, don't get me wrong, I was very appreciative, but sometimes I just want to say, babe, take that back, I don't need it, but I saw Miss Diva liking this purse on Instagram, and I wanted the pouch yet, but the, they lo, no longer make that purse, so if you get that, you have to get it vintage or used, like, from the real, real or Trazy or something, so this was the next best thing to it, and it is called the Eva bag. And this is what it looked like right here. I did get the regular monogram print. Just a super easy bag to put on. I wore this to my little baby birthday party Sunday. Um, when you don't want to carry a big purse. Now this is what I like. You can like um, wear it like this. Where this little chain hang. And you have a strap to it. So yeah. I'm not going to get too much into that. I was just super grateful. Um, and yeah, I've held, held you guys long enough. If you have any questions, leave them below. I gotta go. Thanks for watching. Bye.